Tabo Sefalosh is not a household name in South Africa, but over in America, he's a pretty big deal, playing guard for the Oklahoma City Thunder. Last year, they were in the NBA Finals, eventually losing to the Miami Heat. Sefalosha is back in the land of his father to share his story to a new generation of basketball hopefuls. It's a, it's a pretty long road, you know, but I think, you know, they're at the, at the beginning of something big. And, uh, you know, we, all of us, you know, we're here to, uh, to help uh, give them advice and, and, and hopefully, you know, uh, they, they get back to the country, get back to their team with, uh, you know, some good advice and better players. He's part of the Basketball Without Borders program, which is currently in its 11th year. It offers 62 of Africa's elite young players an intensive camp in which to showcase their ability. Sefalosha's African heritage is something the kids can identify with. I grew up in a, in a house where my dad is a musician, so uh, you know, it was a lot of uh, uh, South African artists coming through the house and, and, and just you know, a big influence on, on, on my life as a, as a, as a young child. So and while Tabo was born in Switzerland and lives in the U.S., he's still a South African at heart. I find a Bafana, I follow a little bit. Uh, my melody sundown, I follow a little bit. So it's, uh, it's good. It's good to be here and, and, and have a chance you know, to, uh, to, to see them play uh, 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 in real life also. Basketball is a tough sell to football-obsessed South Africa, but the wealth of talent is undeniable.